everyone. It's almost the holidays. I can't wait. I can't believe Thanksgiving is next week and Black Friday. Unfortunately, I always have to work every year on Black Friday, but I still like to see what's on sale and possibly try to go shopping if there's something I really want before work or after work or something like that. And then, of course, there's also Cyber Monday coming up, but Anyway, today I have my Sephora VIB haul for you today. I guess I'll start off with the freebies that came in here. When you do an online order, they always give you samples. I'm not really sure if these are even the ones that I chose because they usually give me different ones than the ones I picked. So this is some Alcon, some sort of face thing. And then Bare Minerals Prime Time Face Primer and the Bliss Fabulous Foaming Face Wash. And yeah, that's it for the freebies. Oh, well, uh, for big doing a VIB purchase, I received this grocery looking bag type of thing from Sephora. Um, yeah, so. That's what it looks like. It's light as a feather. It's a little bit dirty already. That's why you saw me checking it out. I don't know why it's dirty. Oh, is it because this is leaking? That's not cool. Um, I will definitely go return it if it's leaking. That's really not cool. So this beauty cleanser is something that I bought for my beauty blender. If you see my beauty blender, I tried cleaning it with the Sephora shampoo brush cleaner and it didn't work. And, oh dear, I'm getting lots of messages. Um, so this looks like it leaked in the container. It's a little bit sticky. Um, that's not cool because I really hope none of my other stuff got messed up in here as well. The reason I picked up this beauty blender cleanser is because I tried cleaning my beauty blender with the Sephora shampoo and it does not clean it off. As you can see, it's still stained. So I'm hoping that the beauty blender specific sponge cleaner will take off the color from the foundation of the sponge. I mean, I know it, the Sephora shampoo thing is supposed to kill off bacteria. I mean, it has some antibacterial stuff in it. But I just don't like seeing a clean brush still have color on it or a clean tool still have color on it. So that kind of bothers me. The next thing that I picked up was a full size of the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil. I love this stuff. In my actual bronzed and the beautiful palette, it does smell like chocolate. But this one... This one doesn't really smell like chocolate, that's kind of weird. But yeah, I like this so much that I decided to pick up the full size. And um, let me just compare the colors. Yeah, I guess they're pretty much the same. They should be the same, but I thought they looked different when I saw them in the Sephora store. I was like, no! It's probably easier to travel with if I don't want to bring all four colors in the palette, or at least I'd have the choice. And then to make shipping free, I had to make my shopping cart over $50. I picked up these Shiseido Eye Lash Curler replacements, uh, replacement pads. Believe it or not, you do have to replace these little pads on your eyelash curler every now and again. I did just replace mine a couple months ago because it was really starting to break up and get nasty. I use this every day so I'm not surprised but it was actually shredding on the top. So I picked up two more of these, well there's two in one packet but it was perfect because this was $6 and it put me just above $50 to get my free shipping. And then the last thing that I'm really really excited about is this. Well, I already took off the tag and everything, is this NARS 500 point reward. I've never owned anything NARS before and I've always wanted to but their stuff is just so expensive so I just never have. So what better way to try this brand than to use the 500 point reward. So it came with a New Lover Velvet Lip Gloss. 
or lip pencil, sorry, I meant to say. And there is the color. That looks very beautiful. This Pro Prime Smudge Eyeshadow Base. Eyeshadow Base? Sorry if I had a weird reaction. I thought it was going to be a mascara base, but I guess I'm wrong. Oops. Anywho, the next thing is this. Pro Prime Pore Fining Primer. I love primer, anywho, so cool. I get to try NARS. And then it comes with this little itty bitty NARS Orgasm Blush. It is really pretty. Literally, I have So, yes, I will get to try this for the first time because I have never owned anything NARS. And then the little baggie that it came in is just really cute, too. So that was my very small Sephora haul. I'm glad that they did a VIB sale since they didn't do a friends and family sale open to the public. I'm a little bit sad. My blender cleanser has been leaking. Thanks for watching and I hope you have a great Thanksgiving. Bye.